Tonight, legal cannabis dispensaries are one step closer to rolling out in Western New York. The state's Cannabis Control Board has granted licenses to four businesses in our region. Good evening, I'm Mary Alice Demler. Hello everyone, I'm Scott Levin. After months of uncertainty, now some clarity, especially for those who have been growing cannabis, waiting to do something with their crop. Join your side's Andy Payton has reaction from one local grower tonight. Andy? That's right, Scott and Mary Alice. It's been two years and three days since recreational cannabis was legalized in New York State, and tonight cultivators are finally starting to see their patients pay off. Western New York's budding cannabis industry reaching a historic high tonight, with the Cannabis Control Board issuing four conditional cannabis licenses to Western New York dispensaries, finally lighting a path from seed to sale for cultivators like Tom Zulist, two years after the law was first passed. This is a new industry. And anytime you're dealing with something new, it never happens as quick as you want it to and as easy as you want to. But in the long term, you know, they're doing it right. It comes after a judge partially released an injunction last Tuesday that prevented Western New York and four other regions from obtaining card licenses, now leaving only the Finger Lakes under that restriction. The ruling marking a turning point in shifting attention to permanent licenses and their anticipated application period this fall despite frustration across the industry over the card program's delayed timeline. We're, we're kind of on target in terms of a, a two year, three year rollout is not uncommon to see in legal states. So while obviously there was a ton of excitement back in March of 2021 when this got passed, the real work is about to be done. For cultivators like Zulis, today's news acts as more of a green light to ramp up manufacturing on his two acre farm, while he waits for greener grass to come with permanent licenses next year. It's a it's the beginning. There's got to be a lot more. I mean, four dispensaries are not going to nearly be able to handle the volume of what we need. So it's a start. Now, in the meantime, cart licenses will continue to be rolled out with 18 additional licenses expect to be granted in Western New York, which will bring the region's total to 22 dispensaries. Reporting in the studio tonight, Andy Payton, Channel 2 News.